better be explaining traffic signals and rules and signals okay okay go ahead don't be shy don't worry okay just be calm so now that is good can you can you speak up man this go on sir The rotation is from west to east, which causes the light. The Earth emits zero point zero six seconds. The rotation is from west to east, which causes day and light. What is revolution? Revolution means the spinning of Earth around the sun. It uh, it results in seasons it takes 365.5 days it takes 365.5 days for uh, uh, for one whole rotation because it takes 365.5 days so every four years uh, we get the 366 days resulting in a leap year what is the revolution the revolution is the axis what did you use to complete this project what are these items two plates and the marbles to rotate that and this one spears and why are you using this ba to rotate, rotate, rotate this one. solar power irrigation system when uh, the earth stresses falls on the solar panels the and it is also controller controller will give the electricity to the pump and the pump will take the water from the pond and Transfer to the tanks. In the tanks, will use the water to the. This is solar power irrigation. It will uh, it will is the low low cost of electricity and fuels. The revolutions absorption of water in the root system. Start. Good morning to everyone. My name is K. Geeta Revolution. I am studying sixth class blueberry. Our biology madam name is K. Vijay Kumari Madam, the science project name is Absorption of Water in the Root System. Now you should take two plastic glasses and pour two plastic glasses and two plants and pour water on it. Later we... Sir, sir we have to show the root absorb the color water, sir. The plant will change into color, color, sir. Color water. In the same way, in the... In the, the same, same way, the, the plant will absorb the water and minerals. Up to the plant. Blueberry. Today, I am, I, our project is hydraulic lift. An hydraulic lift is a, an object by moving in a force of, in a force of partial pressure of, uh, partial pressure of an amount of types. Personally. Hello, my testing. Hello, my testing. Hello, my testing. Hello, my testing. Then, then you are in Kerala. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune are called okay. because they consist of gases. Sir. Next. Okay. Sir, and this was invented by a doctor Robert Gardner in the 1926. Sir, and this was useful to many of the scientists to launch in space. Sir, and we we launch satellites in this space. Sir, by the satellites we know the weather information. Telecasting communications, sir. And now it is many of the countries are launching rockets, sir. And this was the first invention, sir, of the Dr. Robert Gobder.
चाल consist of three parts outer ear inner ear middle ear outer ear consist of pinna middle ear consist of aortic uh, canals and uh, inner ear consist of ear drum and uh, ostial co cola aortic nerves and the canals egg via tissue what is it egg via tissue ये ग्रोडेडिंग फेज है सोनी के ग्रोडेडिंग फेज कौन है और सन टाइम हुए रोटेट सर आउटर लेयर यूज इन दिस इन शॉर्ट पीरियड लास्ट एक्स आर पीरियड इट एच नो सर 22 डेज 22 डेज एंड 21 डेज इंपॉर्टेंट फार्म Pencil contains the 23 23 chromosomes and three main parts. Head, tail, middle piece. Head, the tip of the head part is called acromion. It breaks the wall of the ovary, and it contains and it penetrates the egg of the female. Middle piece, middle piece contains mitochondria. It supplies the person. It supplies the energy to the sperm. Tail, tail propels the sperm. Sperm to the female reproductive tract. I myself Gayatri of 10th standard this is the structure of I we have eyelids eyelashes eyebrows and lagrimal gland in our eyes yet eyeball is present in the eye socket it is the only 1.1 by 6 portion of the visible to us our eye contains mainly three layers sclerotial layer parotidal layer and retina the the outermost thick white covered layer is called sclerotial layer or sclera the second layer is parotidal layer which is in black color and contains lot of blood vessels the third layer is retina we have red in two parts in retina cones rods cones which identify the colors retina which identify the intensity of light thank you sir. very good explanation thank you sir good morning to one and all I, my name is chinman keshwaradi i am studying 9th class and i am from belanki this is india gate the india gate is one of the most iconic landforms of india and and it is located in new delhi it was designed a memorial dedicated to the indian soldiers who lost their lives for british fighting for the british world war 1 and third anglo afghan anglo afghan war it was designed by the sir edwin lufjens one of the most renowned architects one of the most architect of his time the construction of the india gate of the construction of the india gate was began in 1921 and was completed in 1931 Good morning, sir. My name is Chand Kaushik Kapuri, and I am studying ninth class. I am from Jagannath Puram. So this is waterfall. I made it by I made it by using cement pipe and uh, some bent pipes. So in this in this uh, project, uh, the concept involved is is uh, air pressure, sir. So the air pressure is the concept involved in this motor. 
so uh, in reality we know that water has high density and it flows from high place to low place but in 1687 uh, a scientist a french born inventor denis denis papen had invented a mission that from which we can pass the water from low place to high place so we we use this uh, so we use this water pump in a uh, uh, irrigation of agriculture and uh, when we are removing the uh, water from drainage so we will use this uh, that's it so thanks is it easy for you no? yes sir thank you good morning sir this is a structure of nucleus this nucleus is discovered by the robert brown in the year of 1831 generally the size the maximum size of this nucleus is about 20 to 25 micrometers and the width of the dna present in it is 2.5 nanometers this nucleus helps to helps in the transformation of inheritance from parent to progeny there are 23 chromosomes contains in a nucleus and there are 46 chromatids in this these chromatids contains the genetics of the human body there are three three structures in this nucleus this nucleus contains of nucleus envelope nucleus sap and nucleus membrane the outer layer of this nucleus membrane is made by the envelope and it is formed by the enhancing of nucleus thank you sir good Good morning, sir. My name is Vintasi. This is rainwater harvesting. Uh, rainwater is the harvesting sources of collecting water when falls and using when there is water scarcity. When rain falls, the tank collects rainwater. This way, uh, water filter filters the water and uh, this passes through the well, which can used by daily users and drinking water. This is the source when there is water scarcity. Thank you, sir. Uh, filtration sir. filtration I'm going to explain sir explain about human female reproductive system in human female reproductive system there are four parts a pair of ovaries fallopian tubes ureters vagina ovaries Our female sex organs ovaries helps in production of female gametes and female sex organs like estrogen and progesterone. Estrogen helps in the development of secondary sexual characters in age of adult. Progesterone helps to implement embryo. Fallopian tubes. Fallopian tubes are present on either side of ovaries. Uterus. Fallopian tubes are also called ovaries. at end of fallopian tube there is border funnel like opening which receives ovum and helps in fertilization process uterus uterus is the central part of female reproductive system uterus is covered by three layers endometrium mesometrium and perimetrium endometrium undergoes continuous cell di- cell division and endometrium undergoes continuous cell division undergoes endometrium undergoes continuous cell division and uh, when it is thicken it is ready to receive zygote when sperm ovum is released it combines with the sperm cell and fix on the wall of uterus vagina vagina is one part of the female reproductive system which helps in transportation of sperm cells into female reproductive system and what is this called at this stage Is there a different stage of embryo? Yes. Good morning, sir. This is Amni. I am going to explain about human embryo development. after fertilization that means after after uh, after fusion of male gametes and female gametes zygote will be produced this zygote and uh, this zygote undergoes into many mitotic phases and and forms and some cells are in the embryo called embryo some cells are attached to the walls and embryo Thank you.
Do you know what it is called when it is in the bone? Yeah. It's chain. Do you know? Fetus. Good morning, sir. I may see. Good morning, sir. I myself, SK Charisma Mira from 10th Standard. Today, I am going to explain about excretory system. Excretory system is a biological welfare system in the human beings. Excretory system composed of two kidneys and a renal vein and a renal artery and a urinary bladder. The deoxygenated blood enters into the renal arteries through the kidneys, from the true kidneys, sir. And it, the oxygenated blood carries through the renal vein to the urinary bladder. Two uterus carries the waste products from the kidneys to urinary bladder. During urination process, the urine expels from the urinary bladder through the urethra. Good morning, sir. I am myself, Deep Astra from 8th class Strawberry. Now I am going to explain about structure of the plant cell. Cell wall. Cell wall provides the shape and the strength to the cell wall, to cell and the plant. Plasma membrane. Plasma membrane is also called as a cell membrane. It is. It provides the structure. It provides the energy from. The, it converts energy from the sun to form a basic structure, carbohydrates. Nucleus. Nucleus is the place where DNA is stored. Vacuole. Vacuole is used for food storage and plays a role in plays a role in food food conservation. Thank you. Good morning, sir. I myself, we number time studying ninth class. This is the human digestive system. The, the human digestive system includes the mouth, pharynx, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, anus. It also includes the liver, gallbladder, pancreas. The human digestive system, the human digestive system made up of organs, organs, organs that are important for digesting food and liquids. Good morning, sir. My name is Hansuja. I am studying 9th class strawberry. Today, I am going to discuss about circulatory system. Circulatory system is a system which, which circulates water, which circulates blood from heart to all other parts of the body. It is also called as cardiovascular system or vascular system. The circulatory system was described by William Harvey. It consists of three parts. Heart, blood vessels, blood. Heart. Heart is a muscular organ. It, it is it is located roughly at the thoric region and turns slightly towards left. The study of heart and its functions is called cardiology. It, it has four chambers. It has four chambers. It has four chambers. It has four chambers. <laughs> Arcles, uh, the upper chambers are called arcles and lower chambers are called ventricles. Arcles and ventricles are divided by grooves. Heart is a major organ for circulatory system. Good morning, sir. I will uh, I will say about the functioning of the heart, sir. Firstly, uh, blood flows from uh, blood flows from anterior and posterior parts of the body through the superior and inferior vena cava. This is this is left ventricle. This is right ventricle. This is left auricle. This is right auricle. Then the blood is collected from uh, inferior vena cava and superior vena cava. Then the blood is flow uh, flows to uh, right and left auricles, sir. Then the uh, then from the left and right auricles, the blood flows to right and left ventricles through septa. Means 
by a tricuspid valve sir means uh, the blood flows through these valves and the blood then flows and the blood then flows through pulmonary artery and aorta the river uh, in the in the aorta and pulmonary artery, the walls are present, which does not allow the reversal flow of blood. And this is the continuous process which occurs in the heart for circulation. I'm studying 8th class strawberry. This is then and now, sir. How our then and now, how our earth get polluted now? And this, there is greenery, sir, here then. And uh, no factories at all. We have green grass and uh, all animals, greenmans, or gre all greenery have, sir. But uh, today we have, we have, uh, yes sir, our, uh, now sir, uh, now we go to factories and uh, our, uh, our air is also getting polluted and our water is also getting polluted sir now. And uh, because of factories and uh, uh, throwing garbage in lakes and rivers and, uh, and uh, burning crackers in uh, festivals like that we are, we are, uh, we only polluting our environment sir. This, uh, this was about respiration. First, respiration starts from nostrils. These were known as nostrils. Then, air was passed into nasal cavity. Nasal cavity contains mucus, which removed dust from from air we breathe. And this was enters into epiglottis, which is known as pan. This was the pathway which divides air and food. If it was absent, it will be maybe led to death of man. Next, it was led to larynx. Larynx was contained of vocal cords, which is responsible for our voice. After it was ends into windpipe. The windpipe is located in here. This was passage to next lungs. This was known as bronchi. This was divided into two types. This trachea only divided into bronchi. Bronchi was further divided into bronchioles. In bronchioles, after alveolus present, alveoli which uh, covers about 160 meters square, which uh, is uh, similar to tennis court also. When we inhale, this was diaphragm. When we inhale, yes, this was uh, yes. Exhaling means. This air will come out and this will relax. Good morning, sir. Today we are going to explain about human heart and its circulatory system. Mainly what is meant by heart means heart is a pumping organ of blood. How the blood flows from the heart to all body parts means from this way. When heart contains of four chambers. Upper two are called as auricles and down two are called as ventricles. The blood flows from heart to the body parts in this way. First, the, the blood flows from the left auricle and right auricle to the body parts, all body parts. And again, the blood returns from, from the right auricle and right ventricle to the heart. In this way, the circulation will be happen. And how the blood flows from one chamber to another chamber means the left the left ventricle consists of one tricuspid valve. When the heart, when the, the when the chamber is filled with the blood, automatically that valve will be opened. Then the blood flows to another chamber. In the same way, the right auricle and right ventricle ventricle also will be happen, but it contains of bicuspid valve. The, where was the heart is located means the heart is located in the middle part of the body. It is safely presented in a rib cage. It it is it is presented in the middle of the body and slightly blended bended to the leftwards. It it is uh, presented in the middle of the lungs. Now my friend Piyami will explain about blood and blood vessels. My friend my friend Kartili explained about heart. Now I am explaining about blood vessels and blood. Blood vessels are turned into three types. They are uh, arteries, veins, uh, capillaries. Arteries uh, carry more oxygen through heart and uh, body parts. And uh, veins uh, carry more carbon dioxide through body parts to heart. The capillaries are the major part in the blood vessels. They connect the arteries and the veins. Blood, blood was composed by the plasma and uh, 
plasma and blood cells plasma is a fluid portion of the blood blood are turned into three types there are red blood cells white blood cells and blood platelets rbc contain rbc had hemoglobin the red pigment pigment that contain that uh, helps the oxygen uh, that helps the oxygen and carbon dioxide by trans in the we exhale and uh, inhale good morning sir now i am going to explain about internal parts of the flower this is stigma stigma is also known as gynoecium this is uh, Stamen. Stamen is also known as gynoecium and rosium. Female male parts of the flower is called and rosium. Female parts of the flower is called gynoecium. Here, this is known as styles. This is ovary. This is sepal. This is thalamus. This is pedicle. Now, this is petals. The flower. the flower is the asexual part of the plant this green part is known as collar stem stem had collar stalk the stalk bears the head stalk over to the head is called thalamus thank you good morning everyone my name is rishana series My name is Rishna. I am studying sixth class shower. Today topic is serix connection. Take three LEDs, two whites, one switch, nine volts battery. One LED connect to wire, and second LED connect to short leg to uh, second uh, second LED positive terminal. Next sec first first LED sec second uh, positive second negative leg to positive second led next second good morning sir my name is bishalika i am studying 60 class today we introduce drip irrigation it is mostly used in rayalaseema and gunto districts to water plants lack of water scarcity from the well they connect a pipe to tank and the tank pumps the water to plants thank you irrigation system new technology to water the plants then we white perspiration is formed sir this white perspiration is due to double displacement reaction sir after after the mixing of this both chemicals to the sodium sulfate solution and then for then the form of juice is to sodium sulfate solution sir this is due to the double displacement reaction sulfate solution is in blue color sir when we add rusted iron nail in after few hours it changes into green color this is because due to the displacement reaction sir here displacement reaction is taken place this is uh, this is commonly first time sir when we added the first time to the iron nail to it uh, it is in blue color after few hours it changes into green color this is called displacement reaction sir thank you sir <laughs> My experiment is just double displacement reaction, the same, but another can, but with another chemical. When adding the sodium, sodium nitrate, sir, nitrate solution. Take sodium sulfate. Sir. Don't 
then this uh, sodium sulfate solution is added to also this uh, this sodium nitrate is barium nitrate is added to sodium sulfate it forms a white precipitation this is due to double displacement reaction sir this is potassium permanganate this is potassium bicarbonate Our activity name is neutralization, sir. It has its reactive phases and gives salt and water. So I want to show it experimentally, sir. This is a base and this is an acid. This is an hydrochloric acid. from the acid sir this word is it you can see yellow color also that is salt yes salt and water after then how do you know which two ways are separated it is separated when it is formed yellow color sir Changes of color. You can see it is a bit of red color. In acid, because of more content of base in the acid, sir. Then we take a unknown solution, and when we add it. Change into colorless. So the substance of the mixture is acid. When we take another unknown solution into a test tube and we add the metal orange to it, it turns into red. So the nature of the substance is acid. Then we take another unknown solution to it. Then we add a phenolphthalein indicator to it. It turns into colorless. So the nature of the substance is acid. Acid. So it is base color. That is, it is metal orange. Color. Then we add phenolphthalein indicator. When it turns into colorless, the nature of the substance is acid. When it turns to pink, the nature of the substance is base. This is turmeric indicator, sir. When we add with the Do you have any example for colorless one? Yes. When we add beetroot juice into any unknown solution, it turns into pink sir. 
Okay. Okay. Sir, Ravindra, we had about scale. is for the strength, strength of uh, acids and bases. This is the indicator of uh, soap water and uh, turmeric. It turns into blue. This is big base. Big base. Okay. This is the indicator of uh, turmeric and uh, orange juice. It reminds a yellow color. This is weak acid. This is the indicator of uh, beetroot and uh, soap water. It turns into red. Strong acid, sir. This is this is the indicator of beetroot and detergent. Uh, turns into violet. This is a uh, weak case. Removed by the burning of fuel. In our local areas, people do an activity called the gauze, but this is one of our traditional activities. The going inside of the water, the people think the gauze is collecting in the form of water. But the reason behind the process is when we create when we keep the glass in the on the burning candle, the flame slowly stops burning and the water in the plate goes inside the glass. So air is necessary for the burning of the candle. As a science student, we have to away from this kind of activities. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning to all and all. My name is Siri. I am studying 8th class Blueberry. Today's topic is ozone layer. Ozone layer is discovered in 1913 by the French physicist Charles Fabre and Heron Bouchon. The ozone layer is a protective layer of our air. The empirical formula of ozone layer is O3. It protects us from the harmful ultraviolet radiation of our sun. The, it uh, produces harmful ultraviolet radiation. Thank you. Yellow. 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 Yellow.